More students, but no more classrooms. The San Marcos CISD telling us administrators are watching close to make sure every student has a desk when they return to classes on Monday. And as KXN's Lauren Landman explains, the way the city is growing is buying the district some time. <laughs> students are usually the ones front and center for class pictures. But with five more days of empty hallways, it's all about the teacher, although they may tell you differently. I'm just excited to meet my kids, my class of 22. With 22 students, Brittany Bazard's first grade classroom is at capacity for the second year in a row. It's definitely interesting. There's never a dull moment. That story isn't much different when you visit other classrooms throughout the district. We saw the growth coming these past few years. For the first time this year, the district is expected to exceed 8,000 in enrollment, welcoming around 200 new students district wide. But district leaders say there's enough room for everyone. Students are going to be comfortable in their classrooms. It's not going to be overcrowded. In May, the district pushed to pass a $107 million bond to help with overcrowded schools. Construction hasn't started for those projects, but school leaders say they have some extra time due to where students are moving in. It's not just hitting our elementary, not just hitting our middle schools. It's growing district-wide, so it's not going to bring as much stress as people may uh, anticipate. However, the way the district is growing, it says the bond projects will definitely help prevent overcrowding in the near future. Lauren Landman, KXAN News. Construction for the bond projects are expected to begin as early as next year. It includes a new elementary school and upgrades district-wide.